of the job is to teach our customers and our prospective customers uh, as well as what to expect. And so education to me is one of the best forms of marketing because you start giving your customer value before they're your customer. And it's also where you get their attention, you stand out as an expert. One of the ways that real estate agents have used successfully for my entire career has been um, publishing a book or co-publishing or co-writing or using a resource to create a book that you can then share with your prospects and referral sources. I get asked about this regular, about once a month, somebody asks me about it. I do a team member of mine. I, I have four or three uh, agents on my team across the country of probate agents. I have one in particular in Athens, Georgia, who uses a book specifically on probate. And so when I saw a good friend and colleague of mine, Anthony Nitz, has a program on how to do that, I was really excited to interview him. And I asked him to come here and be on their call today. So if you want to learn about how to get your book launched to help yourself build your business, Anthony's a guy. Anthony, thanks so much for joining us today. Oh, Bill, I'm so glad to be here, man. I, I, you know, I love doing this. I love helping agents out. I love sharing, uh, like you've been doing this a long time and, and, uh, and probate has always been a part of my, uh, business model as well. So it all kind of ties in, just makes sense. And, uh, you know, and the, a book in my opinion is the way to go for sure. Yeah. When did you start working with a book? What was that? What was the impetus for you to start that? And, and how long was uh, that process? Um, it was roughly, I want to say 19 years ago it was the mm -hmm. first time I started. I, I, I had the idea of doing a book or I was inspired to do a book. And that's kind of what my goal here too today. Just I want to, I want you to really understand that my goal here is to inspire people to give very serious consideration to having a book as part of their marketing and making it a hub of their marketing. Um, but I, the reason why I started uh, with the idea of a book was because I happened to see another agent who had a book. And it occurred to me at the time, you know, I didn't think about this beforehand because nobody was teaching this and still kind of nobody's really teaching this to anybody in the real estate space. Um, uh, it occurred to me when I had that book, I went, oh my gosh, this is, this is a long form sales letter because I read through it. And, and even though it was subtle, it was still, everything was, was uh, teaching the, the, the reader what to believe and what next steps to take, which meant going back to that person, I go, oh, I got to have a book, right? But the difference was that he was not part of a specific niche. I knew that um, I had to go into a specific niche if I really wanted to have success. And for me, it was a for, or for sale by owner book uh, that I wrote. It was my first one that I wrote. And um, I got to tell you, it was the most painful part of my real estate career ever. <laughs> it took me nine months to write, write that book. book. 